Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Uzian Dakwala. To those of you who do not know me, I have been gone for the longest time. So the reason why I left, I feel like I'm repeating this for like the 58th time, but the reason why I left, and it's probably going to change once again, but it's just a whole lot of reasons, okay? So I'm unpacking one at a time. So the real reason is because when I started a YouTube channel, it was for like faith-related videos, faith-related content, faith-based things. And then life shook me a little i grew up you know and now i'm realizing that i limited myself without realizing it so like i was doing faith related content and all of that i i wasn't i actually wasn't because i'd only uploaded two but the idea in my head was to release face related face faith related content and I realized that it was actually not happening. Like, it wasn't happening at all. And actually, in my mind, I had different content that I wanted to upload. And I was like, yeah, but it's not faith-related. You ever get that feeling where you just feel like everyone's watching you? Everyone is just... <clears throat> we watching you to see. Because in the last video, you said it's only faith-related content. Now you're doing a vlog. What you doing a vlog for type of thing? I was just going through anxiety, if that's what it's called. Like, overthinking and all of that. But, I'm better now. I'm better. So, guys, just get ready for crazy content. Get ready for whatever. Literally, get ready for whatever. Okay, cool. So, as you can see, the title of this video is 14 Random Facts About Me. Let's just get right into it. Now we're starting with random fact number one. And that is, I am very terrified of snakes, guys. Never pull a prank on me um, with anything related to snakes, um, geckos, all of those things. I don't like them. I would faint. Uh, I really don't like snakes. I think it's because of the skin it's because of the shape it's because of the texture it i just don't like snakes they they really scare me and you know when a person's like no it's scared of you i'm like how do you know how do you know how do you know do you speak snake because i don't and i don't know any other human who speaks snake so anyways yeah guys i really am terrified of snakes <laughs> Random fact number two is that I absolutely love dark chocolate, guys. I'm a sucker for dark chocolate. I, oh my gosh, I don't even know how I was introduced to dark chocolate, but I love it a lot. It's like my favorite. I'm assuming it was by mistake, you know? It had to have been by mistake because I know as a kid, I wouldn't just go for the darkest chocolate. I would go for like a colorful chocolate but not a dark one, but I'm in love. I'm in love with dark chocolate. Random fact number three is I am left-handed. I'm left-handed. And no, I don't have an untidy handwriting. My handwriting is actually really neat. I was one of the first people in primary school to get a pen license. So no, it's not untidy, as a whole lot of people say. And yes, class are guys seeing my left-handed people. So random fact number four is that I used to want to be Chris Brown's backup dancer. When I was a kid, guys, I used to want to be Chris Brown's backup dancer so bad. Like, oh, I was chubby. But, I, like, insecurities didn't exist to me when I was a kid. No, like, I'm being serious. I didn't know what insecurities were when I was a kid. Um, so, I just imagine myself wearing those little tights, those little white tights and those crop top hoodies and just break dancing. Break dancing. Yo, and I used to love him and his music. Oh, Trace. Trace, I used to like go after school, after school, I'd go home, I'd take 
take my uniform lying, I wouldn't take my uniform off. I'd go home, ching a kwama zam lena, home making zoe bona later, chow, 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 watch trace and dance. And dance. I don't know how I didn't lose weight. I don't know. Honestly. But yes, that is my fourth random fact. Random fact number five is that my biggest pet peeve has to be people who do not chew with their mouths closed but listen i understand now i understand that some people don't do it on purpose it's because of the position of your teeth right or anything else but i'm aware that some people don't do it on purpose so i'm not like a person who's quick to say chew properly you know yeah so random fact number six is that i am so convinced that i remember taking my first steps so convinced like actually guys i'm i'm just that's it that's it like i'm so convinced that i remember taking my first steps and my mom's tried unconvincing me if that's the word but it didn't work i was like no yes the what you're describing right now i remember it i remember guys i really do and apparently like my granny who was like my nanny she left right so she left for the weekend she went home and i couldn't walk and then when she came on sunday or monday whenever she came like i just i got up and i ran to her and I So anything that doesn't add up though <laughs> is that I remember her wearing a red, black and white shirt, right? Apparently, why is some guy in Kwanzwen in So I don't know, I don't know who's right, who's wrong, but I definitely think I remember taking my first baby steps. So random fact number seven is that my favorite colors are blue and purple and I remember in primary school in primary school we had nuns okay so one of them was our teacher she taught us re which is basically religious education and I remember she went around the class and she was asking people what their favorite colors are and I said purple okay and she was like no not purple purple is an ugly color and I felt so so discouraged and so sad and I felt evil really because like a nun is holy so now if you're telling me that what I like is an ugly color then you're basically saying I'm evil so I felt like Satan's child just to sum it up I was really really sad so random fact number eight is that I love having conversations with myself but I feel like everyone else loves doing this um but I have them like I'm having them now it's guys it's just so therapeutic it makes you understand things and you just ask yourself questions and you respond to them like you don't have people's opinions clogging you not saying like you must just completely shut yourself out of people's opinions because different points of views are good i really enjoy speaking to myself and i think that it's something you guys should try doing it's really helpful it releases stress it makes you understand things you know like and footy another thing i like doing is i'll usually play back my whole day and like if anything made me angry or like someone made me angry i'll be like oh, why did that person make me angry and then i'll try put myself in their shoes then i'll understand oh okay 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 i get it i get it but i don't dwell on like those things that make me angry too much because as you sunny now and random fact number nine ooh. <laughs> sorry guys random fact number nine is that when i was a kid i used to get embarrassed so easily so easily all you had to do was just scream in public and i would walk away i would walk away you know how friends when friends see each other in public and they scream nah no why are you doing that i i didn't understand that i did not understand that i'm cutting it out my pet just i didn't do it for like a good three years i didn't touch pads at a shop because why 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 must i do that why must people know that I'm, no honey no honey 
But now I look back and I'm like, so silly. So silly. So random fact number 10 is that, sorry, I forgot it. I hate conversations about baby pictures. Guys, like, so the story is I only have one baby picture and it's of me as a toddler. It's not even a baby picture. It's like, I think I was one or two or like one in a few months. So that doesn't count because I was already sitting and probably crawling. I want to see myself as a kid, you know, like I don't understand. My older sister has pictures when she was a kid, my other sister, and I don't. Like, I don't know, was I unplanned or anything? It really doesn't make sense to me. At some point, um, I thought maybe like I had a twin brother or sister that they didn't want me to know about, so they got rid of all the pictures. Um, you know, and at the time I just thought they, they just they didn't like me. Like they didn't like me enough and it made me so sad. Like that's why I honestly pray that when I do have kids can I at least have one baby girl that is a replica of me so I can just take pictures of her so I can know what I looked like when I was a kid, you know, you know, yeah guys, it's a sad story. Random fact number 11 is that I am a pretty good dancer and a lot of people don't know this either because when I start dancing I do silly things and then people are like, ah oh, Zenda, stop it. Or like I just don't dance at all or the people I'm around are making me very uncomfortable. But when I was younger I used to dance like really, really well. Uh, I remember this and I'm told also okay but what happened was i lost my mojo when i went to primary school okay so random fact number 13 is that believe it or not i was i'm told this is what i'm told i actually also remember this i was the perfect child guys like un, un, unusually obedient you know, like, like I stood out, like my obedience stood out type of thing. And it just touches my soul when I hear that because I want to go back to being that girl, you know, to being that kid, you know? Um, yeah, but my granny tells me that I was, yo, oh, shame, shame. I was the best kid. So random fact number 13 is I get guilty over the littlest things sometimes i'm like is this still healthy guilt like because i honestly do believe that there's healthy guilt guilt that will make you feel remorseful or um or like just want to rectify your problems with a person or with or like having done something wrong and you want to fix it but yo no it might just escalate you don't think it's healthy guys but yeah shame i get guilty over anything and every little thing so this last fact random fact number 14 is that i my friends have an uneven forehead i don't know if anyone's ever realized but i have an uneven forehead this side is bigger than this side for very many reasons and one of them is because when i was a kid in primary school pre-primary school actually we were playing open gates and there was this brick wall and i literally ran into it head first and um and like i never really went to the doctor to see what the problem was i was just like oh no i'm fine i didn't have a headache i didn't have anything uh yeah and it, it, it like it's always been like this i don't know if you guys can see it but in pictures you can like if you look at me from the left you'll think i have a big forehead if you look at me from the right you won't think i have a big forehead and it makes my face look like lopsided yes shame it's actually one insecurity that i have but i just don't talk about because when i take pictures i just try like like i try hide it i try hide it basically so guys i'm done with my 14 random facts i hope you enjoyed this video if you enjoyed it please don't forget to click that button hmm, bottom click that button at the bottom and um 
click subscribe if you want to subscribe click that notification bell to be notified if i do post any other videos and yes guys hope you stay blessed hope you stay safe and stay hydrated it's summer and it's so hot stay hydrated for real guys bye